Let's go! It's best to me if I die now! Uh, Alright! Somehow I knew Couldn't be that easy Oh, I need to survive for 14 seconds, I think Hello everybody once again, this is Akokazu and welcome back to Secrets of Grindia This is part 5, in the previous episode we killed the face man We killed the sentry and now we are back here To continue the story Maybe on the volume a bit I think that's okay So I'm playing on a hard mode difficulty here and I need to remember how to get back to where I came from Wait, I think we need we can go this here actually Since we uh, I think we killed enough bosses already If I remember correctly, we were supposed to open this gate here by <laughs> Killing bosses. Oh no, we still need to kill one more. So the sentry was supposed to give me, I believe, a key. Okay, okay. I really don't want to fight all these people again. Oh, this sucks so bad. There's no map for this area either. Can I just skip this place. I think I can, right? Yes, I can. Thank God! Oh my God! Why was a sentry the last time? I think it was here, yep. We killed a sentry here. So I think we need to exit here. Aha! Aline is dead. Gun D for them was strong, too strong, and now she's dead. My sweet Aline. All right, we haven't killed Gun them yet, guys. That was loud. All right, we powered it up, so we can keep it there. The detail for this game is amazing. If you guys watch the dodges now, you could see that the. There were engravings, which is actually all the monsters you see here. I think I should level up. Ow. That's a bad idea! Hell. Ow. Run away! <laughs> yeah, and the story about this game is to feed your bag with items. You're actually a collector. For those who are new to the stream. And you basically want to catch them all. I mean, collect them all, pretty much. Alright guys, I think we're gonna fight the main boss. I think I saw this in the images before, it's the guy with the big fist. <laughs> it's not good! This is definitely a boss fight. Okay, not yet. The council asked me to seal this artifact with the rest of our horrific inventions. I can sense a dark power surrounding it, and again! I feel that certain things are not meant for humans to behold. Uh oh. Now our chapter comes to an end and I yet I still miss you, Aline. Professor Pine. It's a boss, alright. Look at this shit. This is Gundam, you guys! I think. Yo, Gundam? They say Gundam died. So whatever is this thing, it's a monster. And when the powers combine, I am... Okay, I'm a Captain Planet. During my thousand years of captivity, not once did I doubt my savior would be the greed of humans. At last, the time is nigh for artifacts to rule mankind. Get ready for the death counter, you guys! Gundam! Ancient weapon. Fight! Okay, I'm gonna figure out the mechanics here, you guys. Fire rockets everywhere. Apparently he doesn't kill his hands first. If 
I learn from my mistakes. I'm gonna kill one hand first. I have a feeling I should try to kill both of you guys. Oh wait, they share, the, they share HP. They share HP, you guys. Rockets are more furious now. Dodging! Dead now. Down. Okay, I can use my face to go up and back in here. Oh shit! So this is the mechanics! Wow, it's damn loud. Apologies, you guys. Okay, so you need to kill the hands first. Or you need to hit the boss. Sounds too easy for some reason! Slightly harder, I guess. I guess it's just the start, you guys. I was trying to teleport down just now, I couldn't. My rockets. Run down, not uh, jump down. My bad. I'm using my shadow clones for those who do not know what I'm doing. Extra damage! Enraged, I think. Yeah. Oh my god. The toll has started, you guys. Oh, um, um. Alright. Alright. The attack must drain its energy. Just focus on defending while he's doing it. Okay, that's a tip, you guys. I need to lower the, the sound volume, it's too loud. Mm, this should be fine. This is the new Ark of Bishop Ness. This game looks familiar. <laughs> Alright guys, that's death number one. Okay, we so we, we got the boss fight until it hits 50%. The ancient weapon. Lower the sound of it. Oh shit, I This part is relatively easy. Oh shit, I didn't jump off in that. I got hit again. Oh no. How? I think I must go to another corner, I cannot stand in front. <sighs> it's hard, you guys. This is hard. I need to figure out a trick. Okay, I must definitely not take damage for sure at the start. That is definitely a must. I 
I need to go to one of the corners. After this, you will be the boss. You will use this thing already, I think. Okay. Maybe I need to perfect block this. What the fuck? It's not funny you guys! Okay, I survive one round. I think I need to break the hands fast, if not it's gonna do it again. Okay, no, it's firing missiles again. This is a good thing, I guess. Chance, guys. Chance. Chance! Going for the below half HP! Why can't I get off? Oh shit. Wait, he's not doing it. I spoke too soon! Now his hands move. Okay. Oh no, this is bad. His hands move now, you guys. I need to be careful of the right corner now. Alright, alright, alright. He's probably gonna do the crazy face again one more time. Can I YOLO this? No, I can't. I'm so close. Link safe. Link safe. Link safe. Link safe. Link safe. Because I think we got this! Oh shit! I got hit! Let's go! It's best to me if I die now! Uh, Alright! Somehow I knew Couldn't be that easy Oh, I need to survive for 14 seconds, I think. Yeah, there's a countdown. Okay, you need to survive for 10 seconds after you hit that part. <sighs> Shit! Guys, it was so close! <laughs> okay, okay, okay. We know how to, we know how to beat him already. I just, no need, I just not need to take unnecessary damage. Should be fine. You should be fine. Six seconds left! It's so hot! Can we? Don't panic, Kazoo! Three seconds! Three seconds! Oh, I was dodging so real!
<laughs> Look at that, he died! Thank God. Oh. So hard! Please! Always the last three seconds, you guys. It's so hot. All right, I'm gonna focus. Oh no! Okay, okay. Can I get hit there? Did it. I just need to chill. Do not make any foolish mistakes. Should be fine. Oh my god! That might have just cost us guys. That might have just cost us. <sighs> Come on! Oh my gosh, do you guys see the last part where I actually slide under towards the center? 
Curse it all! My new one freedom thwarted by a snot! <laughs> Nose chow! My vessel was badly chosen. To bring this bow to his knees, I'll need something more befitting of my limitless power. This guy is called Amulet. For exposing the deficiencies of this metal golem, I have a generous proposition for you. Become my slave and carry me through this pathetic world and search for a new vessel and I shall spare your life. Shut the f- but The bat comes out and scold him. Find a psychic of your own amulet. This one already has a master. A fellow sentinel artifact. Perhaps fortune shines upon me after all. A king! We will need generals! <laughs> Lofty ambitions for mere possession? That string of yours still bears the smell of your owner's neck. Owner? Nonsense! How can a slave own its master? Your long vacation has made you now. it seems. Oh well. Looks like this place hit some real juicy loot after all, kid. Let's bring this thing back to the collector's HQ. I'm expecting great rewards. Dare not speak of me as some male rabbi, rabbi drop. Your laughable delusions end here, peasants. Let me show you the true power of an artifact, Data T. <laughs> what? <laughs> get wrecked. Oh well, enough fun for one Welcome day. Welcome to the 100% right. positive stream and chat. Thank you very much for following and I hope you enjoy your stay here. Kaiser Pop, welcome. Hope you enjoy your stay here. Oh well, enough for one day. Let's get back to Evergrind. I hope you haven't forgotten how to use a teleportation device. Just go into the map section of the menu, select a destination and press Z to summon a teleport. Give me my EXP, man. Stupid gun, damn! Die! Throw a plant on you. Aha! <laughs> well, there we go, guys. I think this is a good place to end. Part 5, a boss fight. Should be great here. Yeah, I believe this should be the end of the storyline if I'm not wrong because this game is not complete we'll find out we'll just bring the amulet to Quinton first and we'll see what they do all right and how do I go to the options menu oh escape okay let's go back to Evergrind City before we end up the episode oh look at the portal it's so cool that is brilliant you guys this is brilliant this game is brilliant so far Wait, this is black market guy. I'm rich now. I think I can buy something. The thing is... All these rings is not what I need. Attack plus 10. Max HP minus 75. I have two rings here. I can take away the max HP, but I like the max HP one, so... Yep. Can't use any of the gold here, but never mind. Let's go to the story. Let's bring it to the collector's HQ. Oh, this is the guy, the rude guy. Hasn't the father taught you anything? Commoners should make way for nobility. Peasants these days. Damn. I think the the amulet guy or amulet guy will want to be with him. Oh, he stole it! Oh man, I called it, you guys! I called it an asshole with an asshole. <laughs> what? How did he? Unforgivable. Don't let him get away, kid. A thieving rival, just as you were to hand the armlet. Mario took him and ran towards Evergrande City Center. Damn, guys! All right, let's chase him first. What's this guy doing? Damn, the story continues. It's not over yet, you guys. It's to be rival. Oh, the mobs are not around this time. Oh shit. This is gonna be a one versus one. You really won't give up, will you? Let me see this opportunity to teach you a lesson about the social order. If you accuse me of saying this envelope, who do you think they would believe? I knew it. If you can defeat me, you can have your trinket back. 
I will show you how a gentleman fights. On guard! Marino! Wow, oh, 5 hit guys. He has a 5 hit combo. Shit, I think we're gonna lose guys. Oh shit, it's not, it's not easy! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Alright, we will defeat two guys in one part, you guys. I cannot take this lying down. I must, I must defeat this guy! Alright. I'll perfect dodge this bitch. I can actually paralyze when he casts that, you know. He has a 3 hit side slash. Hmm. I don't have anything to stun him though. That sucks. Ah, it's another skill fight. I need to regain some EP. He's going for the 3 hit combo. What the hell is 5 hits? It's cheating! Uh oh. We lost you guys. How do I dodge that? I have to block that I guess. Okay, 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 okay. I basically need to, to perfect dodge every of his attack. We got this guys. We got this. It's not that hard. Just need to be patient. Okay. I need to be fast. Oops, shit, I wasn't fast enough there. Okay, okay. Close, 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 close. About one third this time. Oh my gosh, this takes damage. <laughs> it's not as easy as it looks, guys. I think I need to mix up my block and... For well, the line drive part, I need to perfect dodge plus use my block. Then the rest I'll just perfect dodge. Perfect dodge uses uh, an EP. Oh no! Okay, okay. It's okay. okay. Basically, it's alright. I was worried about my EP, that I might not have enough EP to dodge all his attacks, but you could see that my EP was recovering while he was like, you know, dodging and while he was like, waiting and shit. So I think I can just perfect dodge all the way instead of trying to block. We got this guys, we got this. Need rest EP now. Him. Bitch! Fucking Marino! 
Damn it, first look at now this dimwit. Take your worthless trinket, I have no use for it. Yeah, you have no use for it, piece of shit. Stealing from me, let that be a life lesson, brat. Never steal things from people stronger than you. That was quite an enjoyable diversion, but we have business to attend to. Let's go back to the collector's hitch and turn this thing in. <sighs> did it, guys. We did it. Kagebu no Jutsu! Yep, you are able to reset or skip it anytime. You can refund everything. Alright, guys. We will go to Evergrind City. The HQ. Before we end off our part, the story continues. Hopefully, no disruptions this time. Oh, Luvia, you missed. Don't worry, I recorded and I'm going to put it on YouTube, so don't worry. It was really a good stream, Luvia. I think you're going to enjoy that video. But. My, you have certainly outdone yourself. Clearing a temple on your first assignment, an ancient artifact you say? That sounds like something for your father to have a look at. At my age, it's tough business walking up these stairs. Could you bring to him yourself? He's working in the lab to the right of the top floor. Alright. Alright. He's here, right? Aha! Papa! Can I have the free loot? No? Okay. Amazing! Many collectors live through entire careers without finding an artifact such as this. I'm proud of you, both as a father and as a collector. You've got all the talent of your mother. What? Credit where credit is due, old man. Don't forget the one pulling the strings, though I would say the kid did rather well. For a stream like her, anyway. I'm a girl, by the way, guys. Of course, thank you for looking after my daughter, old friend. With your mentoring, I'm confident she'll reach her full potential. Mentoring you bring shame to your kin, you treacherous pouch! What kind of artifact will befriend a mortal? You, your weakness disgusts me. And yet, here we are, Arlet. You're on a trophy stand, and I'm not. I hope your dignity gives you comfort as you rust away in this place while I'm out there finding more artifacts to betray. <laughs> right. But I've already tried the proper channels and you won't listen to me. If the guild master doesn't want to help us, she can tell it to my sparkling green face. It's an elf, I think, you guys. Let's go see what the commotion is about. Wait, we can teleport here. Do I have one of those teleport things? I don't have it. Let's go. It's a fairy. I understand the frustration, my lady, but I would highly advise. I will highly not advise. I'll highly advise against disturbing the master. Master, screw master. I'm not afraid of some silly shot. Then open that door or I'll open it myself. This person is called Nani. Naniva. Don't be rash. You're clearly in the disadvantage. Sure, let's just all calm down and be civil. Stupid, stubborn humans! Ugh! Goodbye, giant doll. I wish it hadn't come down to this. Call. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I was gonna do a Kamehameha. Oh dear. It's her, just as I suspected. This might actually be great news. Come on, Spot, let's go. Let's go. I knew it, there's no one there. Jeepers, this place is so creepy. But I can't be faced. Stick to your guns. Nani! Well, hey lady, I've got business with you. Quit staring out the window and look at me in the face. Oh wow, shit, it's a real person. Master Ivy. And to think I turned down a bark spray salesman just last week. Quinton, will you be so kind as to bring me the fly swatter? It's right there on the table to the far left. <laughs> oh shit, it's a sword! <laughs> no wait, I'm not a bark, I'm a... I know what you are, you imbecile. You're a nosy little fae. And more importantly, the trespasser on our lands. Tell me, lady, but why have you crawled out of your secret little city to come here? Wow, she's like some asshole. Because the artifact in the Temple of Season suddenly woke up and he made Winter Elder go completely bonkers! He took the artifact for himself and now he's stronger than ever, destroying anyone who opposed him. The other elders would sooner die than ask for help for outside hell, but how could I possibly put pride before the lives of my friends? Please, Grandmaster! You have to help us! 
You fairies could go extinct and no one in Evergrande would even notice. Why exactly do I have to help you? Because the artifact that's destroying us was made by humans! Now, now, that's quite the accusation, little one. The fairy only crafts with nature, sticks, leaves, and sometimes stones. The artifact is crafted entirely from rare metals. Who but humans could have made it? I won't send people in the nature based upon the conjecture of a moth. <laughs> Gods! Put their miscreants in a bottle and send her back to where she belongs. Ivy, wait! Hmm? Is it the duty of collector to find rare and valuable items that ordinary people cannot obtain? The Temple of Caesars must have great amounts of valuable treasure, not to mention the ancient artifact itself. How can we stand idle by, idly by and let this chance slip past us? Whether in the hands of fairies, or in the hands of fae, or in the rubble of the city, the artifacts will survive. We do not have any higher rank collector to spare for this mission. When we do, we will bring what we can from the ruins. Jeez, who is she? The devil? My wife Charlotte often visited the fairy when she was young. She loved it there. To honor her memory. To honor her memory. I would like to take this mission on myself. All the manpower I need is my own daughter. A cripple and his kid? <laughs> Fine. I hand this problem over to you. Whether you fail or succeed, make sure that annoying fairy stays where she belongs. Thank you, Grandmaster. Your wife's name is Charlotte. Hey, that means you're... It's a pleasure to actually meet you, Spring Elder Naniva. I have heard much about you. Yes, that's all very interesting. In fact, how should I put this? Get out of my office! Now! Apologies, Grandmaster. We'll continue this discussion outside. What an eccentric old fool. Can I talk to you? Why is he here? <laughs> Why is he here? Can I have that sword? Please? Can I have this sword, please? Damn. Okay, all the strange artifacts. Whew! That was, that was, that was so scary! Why do humans have a leader like her? I thought I was gonna for sure! Lol, haha, <laughs> she can be quite intimidating at times, but as a strong leader, you must be that kind of person, I guess. We got what we wanted, and that's what matters. Time is of the essence, let's make haste. Uh, Chief, sorry to interrupt, but we are getting some strange readings we can't make sense of. We, are re we really need you in the lab! It can't be helped then, I'm not much used in the field with one arm anyway. I'm sorry, Naniva, but can you accompany my daughter to Santa Fe? Of course I will. Be Fe believe children inherit their parents' spirits. It'll be like hanging out with Charlotte again. Haha! <laughs> I'm glad you feel that way. I'll be the best sidekick, sidekick you could ever ask for. So yeah, no, this is absolutely not going to happen. Oh, Dredge! She already has a sidekick! Wait, what did you just call me? Back, please. She might not be a cup of tea to be around, but we need her help. The way the Sunder play and the artifact is sealed shut by fairy magic. You can probably guess whom can use that. Teehee! It's me! Alright, kid, here's the deal. We go to Sizane, find this strange entrance, have the butterfly cast a spell and then we leave her. The faster we do all this, the less likely it is I'll throw myself in the fire. Cheer up you grouchy pouchy, you and I will make the best sidekick team ever. Just kill me now. <laughs> he disappeared. Oh well, see you soon Mr. Husband of Charlotte. We are off to save the day. Please be careful Spring Elder, I'll keep busy in the lab while I wait your return. Okay, kid, I'm a pretty good adventurer myself, so I'll be sure to give you some good pointers. Flash that smile and let's go. New quest Elder Fate of Winter is round a mock, and the spring Elder Naniva has sought to help. You must go to Sicily to the west of Evergreen City to find the entrance to Santa Fe. <sighs> brief, cousin, brief. Alright. According to Naniva, the entrance to the city can be found in the far west, hidden by fairy magic. We get another talent, guys. Alright, this should be the end of part 5. For Secrets of Grindia, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode so far. One boss fight, gun D4 them, and kicking Marino's ass once, even though we got kicked in our own ass a few times. But as always, if you enjoyed, remember to leave a like, leave something in the comments, whatever you want, like how happy you are watching me get owned, death counters and stuff. But thanks for watching once again, God bless, and I'll see you guys and girls in the next part. Goodbye. Let's make a run together, I'll be by your side Before we collide 
And if the sky falls down on you, just beat it up before we collide. Let's make it last forever. I'm ready to fly before.